Hello, I'm Jake from Tiny Nest. And I'm Kiva. This video is to let you know that we've updated our free Iron Eagle Tiny House Trailer 3D models, made in our favorite free 3D modeling software, SketchUp. As with the initial release, the updates and tweaks to this version are the result of working directly with Iron Eagle to make sure everything is accurate down to a sixteenth of an inch. The purpose of this resource is to give a head start to anyone who is thinking of designing their own tiny home in SketchUp and is considering building on an Iron Eagle trailer. You can skip the difficult and important task of getting your foundation right and start designing the house straight away. I mentioned that this video is an update and we're only going to show what's new and not get into the details of building a model on a trailer. To see more about that, please catch up with our original video about this resource by clicking or tapping on the card in the top right. In that menu, you'll also find a playlist of real life videos about Iron Eagle, as well as some more info on our SketchUp tutorial for beginners. Plus we have the entire building series of our own tiny house that we designed using SketchUp. So there are plenty of complimentary resources to check out. So without further ado, here's what you can download right now. We've simplified the file to include all lengths together instead of one per file. So what you see here is what you'll get. A major addition to Iron Eagle's offerings is the addition of a 30 foot option. As with the 28 foot, the 30 is a triple axle trailer and the model now reflects the correct coupler for the higher weight ratings. The larger trailers also required a new tongue jack, which has the added benefit of a front facing crank. So this style of jack is now standard for all trailers because it gives room for another optional feature that has become available, which is bump outs. These are built using the same material as the rest of the trailer so that the process of building out onto them is seamless. Jake has made a few examples on the fronts of some 24 footers to give an idea of what's possible. But before plowing ahead and using one of these, you'll want to check with Iron Eagle on exactly what shapes and dimensions they could make for your trailer. We just flew over the 10 foot option, which is also new. And other than that, there have been numerous tweaks to the spacing of the cross members, which could be important to know for planning drainage or other floor penetrations. And there have been tweaks to the pre-punched hole locations, including the addition of holes behind the fenders, which are accessible inside the wheel wells via some punched out material. So there you have it. If you've downloaded a previous version, make sure to grab this update. And if you're considering an Iron Eagle for your build, definitely check this out and don't forget that you can get $50 off a real trailer by asking for the Tiny Nest discount. We'll leave you with a final link for more info on that in the top right. Plus all other things we've mentioned can also be found in the video description. Thanks for watching and good luck with your tiny house project.